Anyways, yeah, we do just try to make it out, have a fun time, and uh, we try to grow through yeah. this. Yeah, absolutely. So even though we're tired, too, we're just, like, having we're, a good time. We're, 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 we're trudging through, man, and we're going to get winners. Finals here, Sweet T versus Mr. E. Game number one on Smashville. Ooh, that dog on stage. Lucina's well, good, though. She's chilling. Don't got to worry about that. Um, but yeah, all right. So we have our first stage actually starting off on Smashville here, which is uh, the, the stages we saw Mr. Ego um, against. Uh, I think his name was. Uh, Mello. Mello. Yes. I wanted to say Milo. I don't know. Yeah, we went. He went uh, mostly. It was mostly battle for a lot of the. Uh, I thought it was like yeah. two stages on. Uh, we definitely we saw Smashville and we saw Battlefield, but. Uh, not really sure what the preference is going to be here. Um, really oh, strong okay, nice start for Mr. E. He opened up with a ton of percent with the Sweet Team making it right back. Okay, frame trap into the up tilt right here on the platform. It's going to be forced off stage. Ooh, tricky air dodge onto the stage. That's Getting there, punished by the neutral too. Yeah. 100% on Mr. E right here. Uh, Charizard out to play. A lot of kill potential. He's trying to space out that back air, which is pretty much... Uh, the only thing that's going <laughs> to kill outside of uh, flare, flare Blitz <laughs> and maybe like a, a charged uh, smash attack, but those are way harder to land on the back air. Or Charizard. <laughs> yeah. No love. Uh, I think he's fairly decent. Okay, great use of the neutral air again. But All right, that's fair though, yeah. Oh no, he did it too low. Yeah. He's going to lose a second stock to himself there. Mr. E still on his first. What's the play? Gets That's a grab. Right, though. This is game one, and not only this oh is giving us, we see a lot of information yeah, as well for sure. to how he plays. Even if there is an unfortunate SD, you can always bring it back no matter what. Definitely got tons of games to go. All right, that was a nice spot dodge as well, but uh, yeah, Sweet Team trying to just get any kill confirmed that he can. Right what now. a confirm coming out from Mr. E, though, the down air into the forward air, sending him off stage. A beautiful read with the counter as well. Up throw should secure it. Yes, it does. And he's going to switch right on over to Squirtle. Try to get uh, the most out of the stock with Squirtle. He has so much damage on his combos, but it's not even going to matter when yeah. Mr. E is perfectly in his face the entire time. A JV2 for game number one. Looks like he tried using withdrawal to get back to the stage. Yeah. The thing with that, too, is that it's also sending you right towards your opponent, which yeah. is kind of like almost like a double edged sword. You can also <laughs> footstool Squirtle. Um, when he's doing withdrawal as well, and that will put him right on his back, and he'll be, he will be in this, um, invincible. Yeah. He, will be, uh, he won't be able to do anything, basically. I hate to say it, man. I hate to say it, Arisdell, but I think we're out of <laughs> Joker territory at this point. I don't, oh, I don't yeah. think any, any of these players are going to use Joker anymore. Can we at the very least go to Mementos? Try it out. <laughs> Maybe, yeah, we might get that stage uh, pick. But yeah, I mean, when it comes down to the last yeah. uh, few games that you're going to play it, Kind of go all serious mode and be like, For all sure. right, I'll play Joker later. Yeah. Definitely will get tons of love. I know he will. I love uh, him. Twitter's already blown up. I love it. All right, and we are on Kahlo's Pokemon League right now. Uh, this is Sweet pick. T's counter pick yeah. again. Uh, really wide stage, so he's able to run around a lot more. And also, if he needs to, if he's in any danger, he uh, has the ability to retreat to these side platforms and simply just. Thunder Jolt uh, camp from the platform, which is really good for, for Sweet T. Up tilt right here for Mr. E. He tries to chase him with that aerial, but the Thunder Jolt doing Bear. it. Wow, Bear almost. Oh, yo. Yo, Gimps. Yo, we in there. Oh, no. Ah, Makes well, that was back. a good dash back and yeah. then turn around F smash. Um, just, wow, that was good mix up movement. Yeah, absolutely. Take that stop. Great play from Sweet T right here. He gets the combo off of the down throw. Two up airs. Uh, wasn't able to extend that, but picked it up a little bit more with a few other hits. 22% already on Mr. E. Yeah. Went, oh my god. I definitely feel like going P2 too is, might be better than Pokemon Trainer, but as well, it's still scary because Lucina's disjointed sword makes it so tricky, uh, especially when you are the lightest character in the game. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can die so early, especially with that F smash that we see Mr. E land a lot at the ledge there. It makes it really scary. But, um,. So far, the counter pick is paying off for Gucci so far. Um, but yeah, Mr. B definitely playing a little bit of safe right now. Definitely throwing out moves that aren't super laggy and making sure he's not over committing too much into Pichu's territory. Yeah, missed that 
Set up off stage with the down, uh, drag down Thunder, but he's able to secure the stock anyways. Uh, right there, in Sweet T. Yeah. Up two stocks to one, but it's dangerously high percent. That F tilt more than enough to get it. Yeah, you gotta be careful on the ledger, especially uh, I feel as Pichu too. You wanna get out of that situation. Being at the ledger. There should be big damage right here. Getting the platform Whoa. extension into the down air. Mr. E able to sneak out uh, that up air hitbox to kind of break through. That was very, very close for Mr. E. That actually had enough damage that it may have actually sent him into a, a really bad spot. I mean, the Dolphin Slash does go really high. He would have still had his double jump, so he may have made it back, but it would have put him in a bad spot regardless. Okay, perfect. Neutral air out of shield. Nice turnaround back air as well. Yo, okay. Wow. Dang, man. No tipper necessary, even yeah. though it did hit with the very, very edge of the sword. Mr. E bringing that all the way back and taking game number two, positioning him out himself at a 2-0 advantage right now in the set. Winner's finals between him and Sweet T. Let's and I, see. I feel like, sorry to interrupt, uh, I feel like with Ms. Pichu too, it's like, yeah. if Pichu's gonna have any bad matchup, oh, it's oh, gonna sure. be Lucina. All right. In my opinion. All right, we got mementos after all. It's gonna be the final destination variant, but I'm okay with you it. Get it we, get, we get we get the music, so that's high. We can't actually hear the music. We don't have any game audio, which is unfortunate for me. But for you guys, I hope you guys enjoy this music. Let's see what song it, it uh, ended up being. 2-0 advantage here for Sweet or for Mr. E. We're gonna get last surprise as the song. This is uh, game number three. Mr. E working on this 3-0 to make his way into grand finals. Again, this is oh, Aristel okay. and Edmund on the mic. Sweet Tea gonna live a little bit longer on this stock. A little early on that down air, but I actually like the counter pick from Sweet Tea. I was saying, I feel like with Pichu, it's a little scarier because you are racking up a lot of percent, but we see it like bring it back up and then she has that For uh, sure. distorted sword. So yes. This is, in my opinion, a better uh, character choice. But, um, Oh, okay, what, was, All right. what happened there? I'm not sure. I think it looked like Mr. E went a little bit too deep. Ex uh Used up all his resources and was unable to make it back to the stage. I gotta say, okay, Sweet T racking up a little bit more damage. I gotta say, I, I, just real quickly, I love that uh, they show love to all the, all of the Phantom teams. We got Ryuji in the background. Uh, we also have. Uh, what's his name? I I wish I knew. I'm playing it. I'm gonna play it. <laughs> and it's also Pokemon trainer right there. <laughs> oh, you're in for a really long game. <laughs> oh no, all I really play are like a whole bunch of RPGs with like over 150 hours. Oh yeah, this game. one's so I'm used to this it. This one's over like 130 or something like that. That is perfectly fine. I'm used to it. I love it. Uh -oh, okay, uh, he's gonna use the up special to switch oh, right on back. Do the counter, cheeky. That's scary. That uh definitely could have almost. Wow, okay, what a down there, so. fantastic down air coming out from Mr. E. Uh, unfortunately, Sweet D put himself in a really bad situation. He was trying to space out this back air, maybe uh, um, baiting out Mr. E, but he actually put himself in a really bad yeah. situation because he dipped too low, which allowed Mr. E to line up that down air perfectly. Yeah, and he couldn't get the down air there as well. Like, oh, okay, forward smash going to work out for Sweet T right now. Down to our last stocks. One last chance here for Sweet T. He's at 90%. Ledge down throw. Oh man, the neutral air not confirming. Yeah, I think uh, he messed up. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah, he didn't. He didn't go uh, forward. He kind of faded back a little bit with it. All right, fine whip off the ledge. Uh, really good to relieve a little bit of pressure. Up big grab from so far. Always surprised me the reach. But not out of this. Getting that back though, he possibly get a damage card. Down air off stage. I think he's missing the opportunity slightly, but it seems kind of hard because he did say Lucino's uh, up is great one. Okay, and the back air, that's gonna do it. Mr. E taking the 3-0 victory straight into grand finals. Uh, Sweet T with a valiant effort, unfortunately not enough uh, to take that W, but he will. Uh, be able to, let's see if he's gonna be, be able to make a bit of a loser's run here.